Yeah, we definitely do appreciate you. And speaking of appreciation, what you're going to hear right now is something that I, Nature Boy, absolutely appreciate. And you do too. Yes, that's our dancing. <laughs> Don't you see me dancing? I'm doing my coffee dance right now. I think we all in the studio can't uh, get enough of these coffees. They rely on Mother Nature to create the delicious fruit. Now, for the last 20 years, Nespresso has been implementing methods to protect and nurture the soils of the farms and the forests that surround them, as well as supporting the local community. I absolutely we love, love, this. love, yeah. love that. And one of the most important of these is the Amazon rainforest. And this year, Nespresso is turning their focus on this precious area. We love it, making a commitment to protecting 10 million trees in the Amazon forest in La Pedrera, uh, Colombia, as well as supporting the communities that call the forest home. Yes, 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 yes. Are you yes. happy? Celebration. More happy celebration. <laughs> now, listen, to celebrate these efforts, of course, I'm not just going to be dancing. They've also launched their Forest Variations line of original coffees and each representing a part of the rainforest. Today, we're tasting the forest black coffee made from a blend and of shade, ground Colombian and Peruvian Arabicas. How good does that sound? Yes, now the shade of the forest canopy shelters the coffee trees from the direct sunlight and creates a, a, a somewhat cooler environment in which the fruit can then mature more slowly. And that slower ripening of the coffee cherry protects the aromas that later develop during roasting and brewing. And then you get this perfect aroma right now. We haven't even pressed the button yet. <laughs> We're going with the old school on. machine today. It is. <laughs> Pop it on, Pop it and on, we yeah. are going to be doing an espresso for this. So 40 mils of goodness yes. in a cup gives you a quick wake up. Have you had coffee this morning? Guys? I haven't had coffee this morning. I've just been pumped and all the good info coming through, but I think it's long overdue, you, and especially you, this flavor here, which I'm looking so forward to. It's got a, a somewhat of a spicy note to it as well. Um, it's something that I think uh, is not too sweet, but it has sweetness. It's got some cereal notes on it as well, but it's an all round mild body bitterness and roasting with slight acidity, which is just perfect for the time of the morning that we need to just get charged, get celebrating. <laughs> I, I know you are celebrating right now, but that smell and the aroma just hit me out of my know, nose I and know. it just came. <laughs> there you go. Why well, think is this one for me? Huh? Oh, I'm gonna have to make myself one. There's only guess. one. There's only one cup. <laughs> Don't worry, I've got another one. Yeah. Do you have a cup for you? Uh, I can grab one. You don't now, have a cup, so of that's course, fine. Before we get into that, tell me how it tastes. So we first, gotta do a smell. Now that I'm so jealous and I can't grab my own mug. Mm. Mm, mild body, you get that bitterness, you get that fruity aromas from the fruit as well. But this is perfection. <laughs> I know I need to say that this is not my favorite, but this is probably my favorite <laughs> one out of the range. Black Forest. It also has a bit of a Christmas feel to it. Um, so yeah, thank you so much. I would offer you, but COVID, That's so I'm just going to... I'll get it later. Don't worry. I'm okay. celebrating on the side either way. <laughs> yeah. Nespresso welcomes you to a house filled with delight. Blooming with flavour and warmth. This festive season, select the perfect gifts for you and your loved ones. Gifts of the forest. Nespresso. What else? 